Hi everyone, Bill here from Project Manager. Today, I want to introduce you to some of our task management features so you and your team can work better together. First, let's add a task. You can add a task from any of the five project views and that task will appear across your project. Let's add a task in the Kanban view by typing it in at the bottom of this column. Let's click into that task and here's the task card. There's lots of helpful information here, so let's go through it. Here I can update my progress, change it to started, log any hours I've done on the task. These hours can automatically populate a timesheet at the end of the week. Update the due date. This refers to recurrence. So let's say I have to make these reports every week or once a month. I can set a recurrence to make a bunch of tasks in the software so I don't have to keep making the same task every time. Here you can update priority, let's set it at very high, and let's assign the task to some people myself, and how about a teammate so we can collaborate on it together. Here's the text box. Let's make a report for our client, Frank. This is a rich text box. You can add attachments, bold, italicize, make bullets. Very powerful. This is a to-do list for some simple action items for your task. Print out the report, email client. And then as you work, you can cross it out and track your progress. Let's add some tasks for some helpful filtering in the project view and good organization. Reporting, and this refers to creating subtasks. So when you make a subtask, it will create a discrete task with its own task card and it will automatically be a subtask of the parent task, make reports. Down here you can see some nitty gritty details for resource management, cost tracking, and schedule tracking. It's got plan dates versus actuals, hours logged, and the cost of the task. And further still, you can add some attachments. Often you need to add documents, client notes. It takes a lot of information to execute correctly. Over here on the right, we can see a comments section. Here you'll reach out to team members. And a conversation can start. You can add attachments over here as well. Maybe an emoji for some motivation. And that will really get the collaboration going. So that's what the task card looks like in the list view and the Kanban view. You can also manage tasks in the Gantt view, the sheet view, and the calendar. Let's take a look at the Gantt view, because it's gonna be a little bit different. So here you can see the task I made, make reports. It's got the subtask already indented. On the classic Gantt view, most of your task information is gonna be in the data grid. So there's a duration, it's got the assignee, plan finish, so on and so forth. If you want even more task information, you can click the I on the tools uh, tool ribbon here. And there's a tray of some in-depth details about plan start, actual finish, links, people involved, and any dependencies you may have. So there you have it. There's our task management features, and I hope you and your team do great work together. Thanks.